I had someone call me one time and they said, Chris, my, my problem is just too big for God. And I laughed. I laughed right in their face, which I shouldn't have done, but I did, because nothing is too big for God. And the moment you accept that, your problem comes down to size instead of being a mountain that towers over you. When considering the size of your problems, there are two categories that you should never worry about. Number one, the problems that are small enough for you to handle. And number two, the ones that aren't too big for God to handle. In Psalms 18, verse 30, our Bible says, God, God's way is perfect. The word of the Lord is pure. God is a shield to all who take refuge in God. Imagine that, a shield between you and your problems, a divine shield, a spiritual shield, a living shield. Let me tell you a story. In 1967, a driving accident left Joni Erickson a quadriplegic, but she didn't give up. Unable to use her hand, she taught herself to paint fine art, holding a brush between her teeth. And then the determined woman began to write. To date, Joni Erickson, Tata, her new last name, has completed more than 30 books. In her ministry, Joni and Friends has touched the lives of millions. Jesus said this, In this world you will have trouble, but take heart, I have overcome the world. John 16, verse 33. And this is not just talking about Jesus. It's talking about faith and the power that can come through you. That you might have adversity in life, but you can overcome that adversity, overcome the effects of the world. So the next time you face a difficult day or an unexpected challenge, remember Joni's journey. If she could meet all of her challenges with God's help, so can you. Take heart, trust God's promises, and remember that no problem, no problem, absolutely no problem is too big for God.